First, let's get to that breaking news in Seattle where crews are investigating what sparked a fire at a low rise apartment building. It's happening at a building on South Henderson Street. King 5's Brady Wakiyama has been there all morning. Uh, Brady, what's the latest? Hey, good morning, Jake and Shante. Most fire crews have left the scene, but if you take a look behind me, you can see that there's extensive damage right there at that third and second floors of that apartment complex. Now, Seattle Fire got several calls around 3.30 this morning about a heavy fire. A spokesperson with the fire department told us several fire and ladder trucks as well as a as command and support vehicles responded, they were able to contain and take down the fire within 15 minutes of arriving to the scene. Fire fire officials also say a man jumped out of the second floor trying to escape. He's in stable condition and was taken to the hospital. They also say three people were rescued from ground ladders because the hallways were so smoky. We spoke to one resident who is grateful for the cry, fire crews that responded this morning. Like, I was so scared, you know, like, and then, like, you know, people live here and they have their property, you know, like, uh, like, documents, you know, like, and what if, the, like, the, the whole building was, you know, like, burned, and that was, like, you know, it's kind of, like, you know, sad, you know, so I, I'm glad, you know, the team, and, you know, like, I appreciate, you know, the, the, the like, you know, the, the firefighters team. American Red Cross has been called to help displace residents along with a metro bus to keep some residents warm. And as you can see, there's even some fire crews still here checking on some of those hot spots as well as investigating what may have caused this fire to start earlier this morning. For now, live in Seattle, Brady Wakayama, King 5 News. Let's hope everybody's okay. Thanks, Brady.